TCP Z01, you guys. We heard it's a 2650 custom billet lid. All right, all right. Damn, what size throttle body is this? 112. 112. Before we get into the video, let's get into the build. I'd like to emphasize stock block, stock trans, stock unported intake manifold, stock throttle body, um, ESS G3X, 100 mil pulley, six rib, six rib, a four fuel system, E85,000 cc injectors. We did do oil pump gears, crank sprocket, upgraded crank bolt, headers, full exhaust, you know, drag pack, <laughs> poppy stars, plastic dipped in the front, Mickey Thompson's VMS in the rear, uh, 315s actually, not 305s, I know. Uh, and then some BMR goodies. We do have the BMR bread and butter two kit in the rear. And yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. Pretty simple build. Like I said, I can't emphasize enough. Stock block, stock trans, over 1,800 plus hits. Stock intake, unported manifold. Like there's a lot of room to be gained on this Mustang still, but we're gonna keep it a basic simple. So let's get into the video. <laughs> <laughs> so we got the TCP Z01, you guys. We heard it's a 2650, but we just want to show you guys what it's got. Wow. Custom billet lid. All right, all right. Damn, what size throttle body is this? 112. That's huge. This custom? Yep, five inch. Five inch. Oh, wow. That is so sick. And port injection also, you guys. A real deal. So, do you know what it makes for horsepower? Or are we just going to have to say... Nine, all right, we're just gonna say nine, you guys. <laughs> About 900, you guys. It is a manual, so not a 10 speed. You know, he got the man trans in there. But one more shot of the engine bay here. What size pulley? Oh, it's a 90. Wow. All right. Stock bottom. Stock bottom. They take no cam, no heads, everything stock. Really? Yeah, just just slapped a 2650 on there. <laughs> and a port, ready to go. Sweet.
So let me know what you guys think about that 2650 ZL1 video. Um, I don't know. I think the Mustang held its ground pretty good. I shouldn't say held its ground. I mean, we won, but I really wasn't expecting that when I found out it was a 2650. I was like, we got to get the research done and we got to go run this Mustang. I mean, we got to go race the Camaro versus this Mustang. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, I was very, very shocked. It's a 2650. Um, stock block stock cam so stock heads everything you just threw on 2650 port injection and uh full send you know e85 all that good stuff so really really basic uh budget 2650 build but like it made better numbers than me um because as you can see you know it we're we're na you know but being uh twin screw sub you know you guys already know versus a little century blower 5.0 here um but on the hit like i really really screwed it out every single time uh the big stretch he just took the hit obviously and and then on the big stretch too he did count down one two three and so that was very very good comparison out there too but i think he spun so i i really don't know uh he was manual also so keep that in mind manual zl1 versus my 10 or 80 but on the hit though every single time even if he was a 10 or 80 or you know 10 l80 whatever if even if he was that 10 speed i don't think that it would do him any better off the hit from a 30 40 roll per se uh because like i said i screwed out on him every single time on that 30 40 roll so that's pretty much it you guys hope you guys enjoyed it that's the 2650 that's what it does that thing made well over 900 wheel you guys and people are gonna probably gonna say hey, this should have been a 10 speed and it should have been a gutted i mean he's on a full drag pack as you guys saw he's on skinnies uh full drag pack and this is that's why we do the research we we like seeing what things do different builds do and we're just out here having fun none of this is for money um so hope you guys enjoyed it peace uh.